Kyle Tucker fouled the ball off his shin on June 3rd. No surprise. He hasn't played since, though. That is a surprise. Because they called it a bruise. They called it a bruise. They were like, it's good. It's a bruise. No big deal. And we're all like, well, where the hell is Kyle Tucker, man? This guy's awesome. He's a, he's a clinch. Uh, well, what he had, what like, call it? Clutch. 19 homers. Yeah. He's clutch. Yeah. He had, like, 19 homers in 60 games this year. Like, he was on his way to, like, be an MVP yeah. candidate. And we've been calling yep. for it for years. Well, they admitted that it actually has been a fracture. And they misdiagnosed it. All the way back in June, June 3rd. They misdiagnosed it. It's actually been broken the whole time. Yeah, this is what he said. He said it came up with a lot of inflammation and swelling in the general area. And then after a little bit of time, continued imaging after swelling and everything kind of calmed down because things can swell for a long time, right? Mm -hmm. It was mm -hmm. revealed there was a little fracture in my shin. Ow. Things don't <laughs> swell that, that long. Brad, if you're not tr if you're not treating it right, it's oh, it's a contusion. It's a contusion. It'll go away. It'll go away. Right. Like you ever you ever like sprain your ankle and try to walk it off for a couple days? Cause like, ah, oh, it's not that bad. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. It's yeah. Awful. I've done that. And then like I went to the doctor <laughs> on like four days later. and He's like, no, your ankle's jacked up. Actually, let's put you in a boot. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. No wonder yeah. I couldn't walk it off. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's an that athlete thing, right? Walk it off. Rub some dirt on it. It is. I grew up that way. I feel you. I'm still that I think way. We all Let's did. be honest. <laughs> That's why I got to the point I'm at. Okay. <laughs> That's the reason I, my ankles are like paper mache. Yes. Yeah. I Brad talks about times. his 30-year warranty, that we all have a 30-year warranty <laughs> on our bodies. Uh, I cashed mine in much sooner. <laughs> I was like, I don't need that. I'm going to buy out. I want to buy out. <laughs> anyway. So uh, Brad thinks this is pretty sure this is the same thing that happened to Anthony Rendon last year. Well, right. Remember, they're like, oh, he's got a bruised shin. And everybody's like, that seems weird. He's been out for six months. And yeah. then finally, like right before the end of the season, like, oh, it's a it's a shin fracture. He's going to be out the rest of the year. And it's like. Yeah. Okay. But. But to be fair. <laughs> to be fair. Uh, Anthony Rendon hates baseball. So, well, right. I'm not inclined no, I understand to believe that, but anything. Same, but I mean, to be to be fair to Anthony to Rendon, fair, gotcha. he did come back this year from injury, and he's been playing pretty well. No, Brig, I watched no. it. Oh, you I watched go ahead it. and watch it all you want. I'm not buying it. <laughs> but, I'm not buying it. I'm not saying he was pushing to come back last year. What I'm yeah, saying no. is everybody, when we were all like, wow, Anthony Rendon is really milking this whole thing, like really milking the shin bone injury, right? Yeah. The shin bone bruise or whatever. And then finally they came out like, yeah, it was actually a fracture. It's mixed, misdiagnosed. Bro, when I decide Apparently this is like I a thing a that happens. When I decide I have a grudge, it's like a John Carlos Stanton size chip on my shoulder. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I get it. Yeah. It used to be the Jacoby Ellsbury chip. We've since been renamed. This is rebranding.